What's up, everybody? It's your boy Melvin here with our story time. I hope everybody's doing great. I know what I am. And damn, what a day. It's been a while, hasn't been? Well, what do you expect? When you, I say the last two days were great. My graduation day, and I went to see Buzz the Lightyear movie, which I have to make this clear. When I saw, like, the people, like, you know, from the other countries think there's supposed to be, like, a, a scene that they all want to cut off. When I saw, like, okay, I, and the rest of it was good. I don't know what's the problem with people with that scene. It's like, wow, what a bunch of homophobes. Screw your practices because, hey, it is, it is, okay, the movie didn't... Okay, that one scene there. Okay, we all know what the scene is. The, uh, when... Okay, f there'll be a spoiler alert, so for those who haven't seen it, mute it. Mute your video. Mute the video. So you won't hear the spoiler part. They didn't mention nothing. Yeah, there was only one scene when they embraced, but that was it. The rest was, like, when Buzz keeps coming back. You see, like, the growth of the family. That's it. Nothing else. Which I find the ones who start sparking these controversies are mostly the Karens, these idi religious idiots, you know. Get over it. Now back to the main topic. So I hope everybody's having a great time. And how I did my graduation? Well, I'm going to tell you about it. But before we begin, did you subscribe? Did you hit the bell? If you did, what the hell you been doing the last two days since I was gone? Hit that subscribe button, hit the bell so you won't miss a great content. And also like this video, it'd be awesome as well. Now let's begin. Back at Thursday, I like I mentioned, I was in my graduation today. I had to wake up like at 4 o'clock in the morning because we had to get to the uh, the convention center here in the, in the capital. Which, okay. To get this how it gets this wrong, there's like a, uh, okay, the pro how everything has to be proceed. Every store has arrived like at 7. We arrive like at 6. The registration is open at 7. One for the, the student, the teacher faculty, one for the students. We enter there. There's also a changing area we put on our togas, you know. And there's also the the place where you take your pictures as well. We have to fill out the card after you change your toga, then take your picture after that. You have for the, the table where is that the food? The food is mostly like sandwiches, cookies, orange juice, you know, coffee, nothing else. Mm, the cookies taste good. It tastes like it tastes like the cookies you get from uh, Sam's Club or Costco. But yeah, there's also a selfie one as well, which damn the line was big. And I was just walking around looking for my friends. We were just talking. And wait until the, when the show starts, because, hey, there's also, also, a, members of the, uh, you know, the crew, like, give, asking us, well, what are we graduating? What's your degree? Those. And this is broadcast, both in Facebook and also on TV. Yeah, because the graduation of ours is Channel 1 here in Puerto which is broadcast live, so yeah. Which is kind of cool, both on Facebook, YouTube, and on the t on the television. So that's kind of cool. And you're wondering how many people are graduating in my class. This is big because this is like combining comp uh, of all group, all the schools from the same university. Okay, this is only the the schools that participate in, in the University of Guarabo, which is the main unit. You got the ones from the the Metro and those. Ours is from the Gorao. So, by the total, how many students are graduating? About 5,000. So, that's a lot. <laughs> like a small little army. And, yeah. It was kind of good. Out, me and my friends were just watching the screen. Everybody interviewed. There was even a, uh, a marriage proposal, too. Which is pretty cool. And also, we're just waiting until the, when the everything starts for the, you know, the, the lineup. For the graduation ceremony, which damn, they took way long because okay, the other side of the lineup is to go by a different degree. First, you got the doctor's degrees, which <laughs> they're the first ones, and there's only a few of them, so they're like walking easy. 
The rest of us just stand there watching the master's degree leaving. Which we're like, and my feet were killing because I'm wearing shoes of size 13. I'm size 15, couldn't find. I squeezed into a size 13. And tried standing there like almost an hour, waiting to get start the walk to the graduation ceremony. And me and my friends, okay, they not say how many people are graduating from our school. It's a lot. Because the original was called the International School of, of Design and Architecture. Now it's called the International School of Design, Architecture, and Engineering. So there's not a lot more of us than any other school. And it's kind of funny. We're all standing there watching everybody going in. It takes us time. We're just standing like, I was like making some jokes like, Move it! <laughs> we were just watching the whole screen seeing. Damn, talk, 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 hurry up. We just want to get in already. It's our big day. <laughs> and to understand what it looks like, okay, have you ever been to, you know, Comic Con Puerto Rico? Yeah, it's that room. It's that area where the Comic Con was. In that room of section at the uh, convention center. And we're still waiting, and damn. No, I, I, okay. The, I was talking to, like, a friend of mine from the same class, and I know it's a lot of trash. Like, damn, they should change our, I think they should change our mascot from the, the natives to the piggies, because there's a lot of garbage that haven't been picked up yet. The, you know, the, uh, you know, the protection shroud, the plastic shroud used for putting on, you know, your suits or your, or your toga? Yeah, that. And that was a lot. It was annoying. Damn. You don't know how to clean yourself? You're graduating and you still don't know the meal where to pick up your trash? Damn. You didn't learn from Barney, ain't you? <laughs> but yeah. <clears throat> the graduation was good. We finally made it and boy, there was a lot of people watching us. It's like you're just watching the home team. <laughs> But yeah, it was a cool experience, actually. Uh, besides, if you ask me which university graduation looked cooler, sorry, okay, sorry, ours looks better because I'm gonna tell you why. After the okay, after we arrived, we've been seated. The the ushers set chose to our seats, which we. Actually, where we're sitting, we're more close to the where the main podium is with the all the professors, calling the president of the university. Yeah, you all the question is there like a national anthem? And no, that's dead last. And it's not the anthem like you know the the country. It's actually the anthem, the, the school anthem. Yeah, the school's own national anthem. Which is kind of funny. It's like short, but hey. After that. They were doing like the honorary award, like one was for giving an honorary doctor's degree to this professor who did a lot of good work during the pandemic, like helping with the vaccines. That that was pretty cool. Then was the musical performance. I think there was three. One was I think everybody who had been in Puerto Rico who hadn't graduated in elementary school knows the song "Borica hasta la luna," "Borica to the moon," which is uh everybody knows that song. And we're just watching, like, <laughs> I mean, I, oh shit, this song again. <laughs> but yeah, after that, you can keep more talking about, you know, you know, the, you know, the, this, the, the, you yeah, had the one of the press target and the other, like, each of the current, the timeline, you know, we have this of each hour. Because the graduation was three hours. That's how long the graduation was three hours. After that, it's time to get the degree. The first was the ma the doctor's degree, which okay, they actually called them by their names. Which imagine, okay, the only who get lucky to get their names called to get the degree was the doctor's degree. I have no problem because I'm, okay, the rest of like imagine they did with us and that, okay for the ones who are taking bachelors, that's a shitload of us. Imagine how we have to call every single one. And we were last, and they go actually the way they did was by a row, so they won't have like you know like a whole mess. And after that, 
<clears throat> we may have to get a roll up, and damn, we were just we were just looking at the screen and say, hey, look at us. Because, face it, because, you know, the parents, the family, the way in the bag, they had giant screens. Like, I think there was, like, three. The big one in the middle, and the one on the left, one on the right. Or you can look up on Facebook to be much easier, because remember, it's, it's in live. It broadcasts live. Of the, of the graduating sermon, so, yeah. You can watch it on TV, or on your phone, or in person. <laughs> but, yeah. It was pretty cool. It's, I was I... We managed to get up at the podium, get our diploma. We're just like shaking hands with the faculty, calling the teachers of each school, calling the president of the university. When we finally got our university degrees, the teacher, you are now officially graduated. And we did for our hats. There was a whole shit of confetti, red confetti, which is the color of our university. is now red. Which is pretty dope, calling the paratechnic, you know, the sparks. And then the performance. They brought like these, like, you know, these performances. Like traditional performers. Like one of these on little stilts. It's called a vejigante, which is the... If you don't know what a vejigante is, it's one of those, you know... If you haven't seen, been to break one of those festivals, the those guy with those masks, like monsters masks, those are vejigantes. They're part of like tradition, culture, of folklore. Damn, it was awesome. Literally, the performance. <laughs> It was damn cool. Damn. What else? I think one of them ugh, throw confetti at one of the doctors and create, hey, confetti! <laughs> it was pretty cool. Like, yeah. But, yeah. I give props and kudos to this. It was pretty cool. But, yeah. After that, we left. It was the time for the exiting, which is the most important thing, because, hey. It was time for the exit, which, yeah. Which was very important. And literally, we just, like, it, no, they were doing it backwards. Like, you know, the, 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 uh, the process, the, uh, the procedure. They actually do it backwards. First was the uh, we were li now leaving. We started checking. It was the whole faculty. First was the faculty leaving, then us. Actually, the faculty were right there, shaking hands with us, say congratulations on achieving your degree, which was pretty cool. I was shaking hands with my coach from the team. That was awesome as well. After that. Me and the friends got to the booth and took a whole like a, a, a photo group photo together of all the who graduated in degree. Us, I think that us grad those who graduated from graphic design, which is pretty awesome. <laughs> we just like no, me my friends are like okay, all the the tall guys in the back and faces. There's like three, me and two of my other friends. We took like good photos and it's like awesome. After that. Damn, the whole lot of people outside. Because, well, you expect. After that, I left. I left with my parents, and we went. Oh, and you're wondering where I was at? Red Lobster. And it was good. I ate the. I think it was. I can't remember what it's called. It comes with the, you know, the shrimps and the, the, the tailback, the lobster tailback. Yeah. And the mushrooms with the cheese. That. But, but yeah, it was pretty cool. The graduate was memor memorable. And I already made a speech about the one, all you guys who are graduating this year. Hey, now it's time to get my master's, which is a big moment for me. Which I'm proud of. But I hope you guys get inspired by this and to achieve your goal. I hope so, because, hey. You fire again a great career or be a bum? You tell me. You tell me. But yeah, I hope you guys had a great day. Remember to follow your dreams. And also, don't do anything stupid. Because, hey, it's better to continue studying. As for me, it's time to get my master's. And another chapter in my life, so wish me luck. But, until then, 
Remember to subscribe, hit the bell, and also, have a great day, everybody, and see you tomorrow. And also, tomorrow I'm going to put up the, the logo of my documentary, so that'll be awesome. So, see ya, and have a great day.